Xbox unsnap. Well, guys, this is Ben with uh, Statistic Pitzel, and we're going to do some Queen's Bounties. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, uh... Sorry if I'm a little awkward. It's the first time I've ever done this. Yeah, do you know, talking over a game. It looks like they gave us an easy mission this time. Yeah, the Queen's bounties. I don't think they're particularly difficult, especially if you uh, abuse the element. That's strong for these missions. The this one, it looks like it's Ark. If the fallen haven't gotten to it, there might I've be got an Ark sniper rifle right here. Uh, oh, I swear these speeders just ripped right out of Star Wars. right here. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but you don't have to sit and wait for Dinklebot to talk. You can just run to the next objective. Which, if you're like me, and you've been playing the hell of this game, you should know exactly what you have to do, because you have to redo everything. Multiple times. Blah 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 blah. Just wait. He's talking. What we really need to find is a warp drive, so we can jump to any planet or moon. Our only hope is where we found our ship. We have to go back. The the enemies don't get tougher until you get to the dark zone. But if you guys haven't tried these yet, uh. These got the enemies are much more powerful than they are in uh you know regular level 24 missions. They do a lot more damage to so you. For the warp drive. So you have to be a little more careful. Bad news. I guess if you guys are if the Halo fans are out there it's going to be more akin to the legendary setting. Whereas you know on heroic and whatnot you can just, you know, kind of just run in, and take everyone down. And to those of you who don't know, uh Look at the color shield, and that corresponds to the damage uh, that they're weak to. Like those uh, those shanks, see their shields red, so they're they're weak to uh, solar damage. Blue is they're weak to arc, and vice versa. You see, in this mission, arc does a lot of bonus damage, so you just rock an arc sniper rifle, and that's that's all you need for the mission. Watch, I can probably take him out before he even gets out. It's in the walls. Yep. Uh, incredibly easy. Incredibly easy. If you see, I, I'm got all legendary equipment, oh, except for that, which I need to break down. This could cripple the fallen. We need to go see this. Yeah. Uh, I've gotten most of my legendaries just from uh, you know, marks and uh, leveling up my crypt arc. Which, if you see a blue Ingram, don't pass it up because it's worthless for you. Take it to your Cryptarch, level him up. Like, y you'll get something good from it eventually. Like, one time I leveled him up, I got two Legendary Ingrams. One turned out to be an awesome assault rifle, the Dr. Nope. Oh yay, another helmet. Do another Queen's Bounty. Probably do two or three. You guys notice I'm level 29 and I have you know, all my gears maxed out at this point. Um, I, apparently to get to 30, you need to do the raid. 
And uh, during the collapse, they transferred. Yeah, we only have four people in my clan at the po at this moment, this point in time. So, uh, like, if any of you viewers out there want to uh, join our clan, we're the geriatric fluffy bunnies. I'd I'd love to have you. Uh, we're we're a small group, mostly close friends. But we're we're always up to uh, you know, meeting new people, and you know I've like hell I've I've grown close to a lot of people uh, I play Xbox Live with. Sorry about that. Yeah, I've grown close to a lot of people I've met on live. Xbox, stop listening. I've grown like a. Uh, Two people in particular are going to be, you know, I've never actually met them before, but they're going to be in my wedding in a few months, so I mean, I'm, I'm always down to meet new people. Hey, if you want to join, just uh, get on Bungie.net and search for Geriatric Fluffy Bunnies. Uh, I, I check it generally every day, so, uh, you know, I'd love to have you. Okay, uh, what mission is this? Oh, Skate Lord? Yeah, this mission's not too bad. If I recall correctly, everyone's weak against solar damage. I'll use my scout rifle and my pocket infinity. Oh, the pocket infinity you get by uh, doing an exotic bounty, like I'm picking up a the, heavy uh, the bounty giver I can use it to get into their network. gives them to you somewhat randomly. Like, I'm not sure the, uh, the, yeah, the methods to actually unlock it. Oh, cool. Uh, Spirit Bloom. Yeah, make sure you guys, if you pass any collectibles like that, stop and pick them up. Uh, it makes the grind so much easier when you don't have to collect that many. Oh, there's another one off the, right over there, looks like. Who is that? Who's smoke a sweet? Did I play it? Oh, just ignore him for now. Yeah, I don't. I don't, don't generally just join random invites. If, uh, if you guys ever send me a message or invite me to play a game, uh, just, just send me a short description of like where you where you heard about me from and the uh, or. Not even that, just, uh, you know, what, what you want to do. Because if I'm already job. doing something, I'm, I'm not going to just drop what I'm doing. Oh, that's right. Gate Lord. Unable to summon, unable to summon, and bam. This mission is not too difficult. You just have to be wary of, uh, all the snipers that are around. They just, uh... Uh, they demolish you in one or two shots. If you have a, a flame sniper rifle, that's probably the best weapon for this this mission. Uh, I'm sorry, I say flame. I meant solar. To find the gate lord, I sort of had to mess with all their transfer gates here. You're probably going to have your hands full. Oh, Dinklebot, you're an asshole. You know, I don't necessarily hate uh, Dinklebot's performance in this game. I mean, it's not its not the worst I've ever heard. But it does sound like he kind of phoned it in a little bit. Oh. You guys wondering... If you guys are wondering why uh, the gates are these guys are exploding whenever I kill them. Because I this... Scout Rifle is a perk for... Uh, Keep it up. Exploding people whenever you do a first kill them precision shot. There we go. It does a little AOE damage, but it's it's nothing to really write home about. Oh crap. Oh. Oh wow, I already went down. Oh, that's a bad start. Oh well. Yeah. Yeah, I know I could have used radiance there, but. I I choose to use it like if it's in a bad spot, like mainly in boss battles where I don't want to restart it or whatnot. 
And just for this, you know, I don't, I don't want to wait for uh, it to regenerate. The it's only a few waiting. enemies. I can kill them They'll again. Keep coming unless you can shut them down. That worked. Keep it up. Yeah, these missions, they aren't easy. I'm a level uh, 29 Warlock, and they still take me out pretty quickly. I mean, if you're level 24, you can solo, solo this pretty easily. Just you know, keep your distance, be careful. And try and have a, flames, a flame weapon of any kind, because it does so much extra damage. If you're having, hold on, if you're having trouble telling, uh, look at that bottom left corner, right above where it says unable to summon, like that middle icon, that's for solar damage. Like all these Queen's Wrath missions, they always have an have a element that's much stronger. You just abuse that, you'll, you should be fine. As, as you can see, I, I I like to rock the Sun Singer, and because uh, it saved me and my fire team quite a few times. That you know, the, at the end of a strike, especially Fogoth, who we seem to have a hard time just defeating at, when this game first came out. And make sure you destroy the cage, otherwise the enemies will just keep coming out of them. And I think there's a sniper up there. If you get one shot off of the sniper, uh, they, they really can't retaliate. Especially if you have a high impact weapon. they do oh. Oh, kind of got it. he kind of surprised me there As you can see, fire damage is just so overpowered. It takes most things out in a single shot. Yeah, like, I know a lot of a lot of you who have done the Queen's Wrath missions. Don't be discouraged uh, if you keep getting the same piece over and over again. And it's going on for another week, and then I think it ends next Tuesday. Uh, like you should be able, you should be able to get something. Like I've gotten a a void sniper rifle and a, a legendary ship, which is the one I'm using right now. Let's see. Did I take that one out? Yeah, I did. I, I don't agree with what Bungie did. Uh, was it, uh, it was such an easy way to get shards. Which, uh, sending shards are kind of difficult to come by. Oh, I got a text message. Let's see who that's from. Oh. 
Just another person that's a sadistic pixel. Uh, oh yeah, it's like this, it's like this because we're all big gamers. Like, uh, I might be a little more hard, more hardcore than most, but yeah, it is what it is. Yeah, if you, uh, in a few days, I'm gonna start streaming uh, some older Final Fantasy titles, probably starting with seven. Which uh, I know I'll get hate for saying this, but it's one of my, it's probably my favorite one. I mean, eight was the first one I played, but. Uh, there's something about seven that really just caught my interest in probably why I love RPGs so much. But I really do enjoy the older titles as well. Uh, I haven't really given six a fair shot yet, which I, I know a lot of people probably crucified me for on crucified me for on the internet. Oh, snap. I'll screw it. It's close to the end. Yeah, these guys, uh, uh, lost my turn. I thought there for a second, guys. All right, these guys, if you just shoot them anywhere, like shoot them ahead and then I miss that shot and shoot them their weak spot while they're stunned. Uh, it, it kills them nearly every time. If you have a, you know, a decent high powered weapon. Oh, he'd already been shot. About to go down. Oh, oh just behind me. Ooh. Gotta love that overshield. Uh, like I've noticed that they're they're pretty generous with uh, precision shots in this game. Like I've noticed, it doesn't have to be exactly like spot on, especially with the Vex. Oh, supercharge came back pretty quick. Oh, come on. Come on. Yeah, if you guys have already dropped this game, uh... You know, in a few days, Bungie's supposedly coming out with a patch that will fix the, the uh, you know, the legendary Ingrams. Uh, it, it won't, it won't help anyone. It won't fix any of the ones you're, curr you're currently holding. Those will be eventually changed to blue when that patch hits. So, uh, you know, every, everything you collect after that, you know. Aw, oh, damn. I hate it when they're immune. You see, see this is a flame based uh, rocket launcher. I just decimated him. Uh, don't worry about going. You don't have to worry about going down at this point. After that, after he's down, the mission's over. Nice the enemies still spawn. This better get us in to the Black Garden. Let's go get our key from the Queen. And you don't have to kill them. If you die, then don't worry. You'll you'll still be taken to the mission complete screen. But I don't want to go down without a fight. Or at all. Where we go? Oh. 
Oh, yay, another helmet. You guys will get a lot of doubles. Yeah, like, I really wish Bungie had, uh, had let us put our own modifiers on missions. Because the epic modifier makes these so fun. The enemies do a lot more damage, uh, it's a lot more challenging. Like, even the, you know, the level 28 missions are not that challenging once you're at the, you know, at equal level. But it needs a warp drive if we ever hope to fight beyond Earth. And that Cosmodrome is the only place I know where we might still find one. We survived the Fallen once. We can do it again. Yeah, I've noticed something that's a little odd with this game is, uh, the... Hmm. Lost my train of thought again. Oh. Don't do drugs, kids. Not that I do them. A guardian ship was recently oh, shot seriously? Down. This mission again? There might be parts we can salvage. Yeah, you'll be doing the uh, the same missions over and over again, just like I over and over again, just like I said. But yeah, the epic modifier just makes the mission so much more fun. Uh, something to note with the, the nightfall strikes, you guys are having trouble with that. If you guys have a decent, like, legendary weapon of it, of, uh, like, I think this week it's solar that does more damage. If you have, like, a decent legendary solar weapon, you can easily solo it. Like, I, I might st uh, stream an another solo run for that. For the, this week's pretty soon. Well, I think it I think it resets tomorrow. Oh. I'm playing like I'm using a, a, a scout rifle still. They managed to restore an information hub here. Down in the tunnels below. We should check it out. Yeah, I'm using the Soros re regime, I believe it's called. I bought it from Zur while while he was here this week. The entire area. Uh, it's not a bad it's not a bad auto rifle. It's a, uh, it's a lot like a, a scout rifle that can go full auto if you need it to. But yeah, I I like it because I I can pick my shots. But if someone gets uh, you know, right up in my face, I can just you know, put down my sights and go full auto if I need be, if I need to rather. You notice I, I don't use my sparrow as often as, as I should. I know it lets you get Scanning around faster, but uh, there's something Bad about jetpacking everywhere fun. you need to go that's just I find really fun. I hope you're or gliding, I think it's called in this game, but uh, it's a jetpack. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't stick him because that uh, that would have killed me. Where is he? You see, once you get their shields down, like if they resist your elements, once you get their shields down, they're uh, they're really nothing. That's a random grenade. Yeah, if your shields are go down, go down, just you know, retreat back to this room. Nothing will chase you past right, right here. He's dead. It's in the walls. Oh, didn't kill him fast enough this time. Sorry. Still dead. You just killed an archon, and we oh, got, got the robes drive. this time. This could cripple the fallen. We need to go see the speaker. Oh. 
Oh, if you guys noticed, my my head was on fire. If you haven't completed a weekly nightfall strike yet, uh, for some reason your head, you know, catches a flame, and you get more experience and reputation points for you know every activity you complete from then on. But I believe uh, tomorrow I'll lose it when the new weekly strike is loaded up. And more queens missions can I do? Five more. I'll probably do one more and call it a video. Plan to charge the Gate Lord's eye. Deep in their war base, the Cabal are sitting on a Vex spire that connects to the Black Garden Gate. We free that spire. Well, we can different mission. The we'll be hitting the Cabal where they're strongest. So I hope you're ready for war. Here we go. Let's okay, it looks like it's uh. Base. Play him again. Scout rifle. Let's go ahead and break these down. Yeah, but you know, overall, I, I really do enjoy this game. But it uh, it is pretty grindy. Which I mean, if if you're a fan of MMOs, I I suppose uh, you know, you're not gonna mind too much. Oh, oh, public event. Let's stop and help this guy out. See if I make it in time. He's dead. Oh, awesome. Good work. Like, you know, I really don't understand the gold tier. Like, I, I find as long as, uh, well, I mean, the tiers in general. I find as long as you complete the mission or the event, like, you get gold tier no matter what. Like, I, I've walked into a, uh, one similar to that where he literally just had a sliver of health left. I, I, I shot him once, killed him, and uh, got moving. a gold tier for I'll that. For a good like, not that I really earned it. Yeah, yeah the, this mission is pretty tough. Ah oh, man, missing my shots today. I don't know why, it's not like I have an audience right now. I believe the other modifier is enemies don't flinch. Right now, These little scion guys. Uh, oh wow! Can't believe I missed from there. Yeah, they they do this uh, weird, uh, you know. God, I'm terrible. Man, I have to go kill myself now. Oh no, not gonna die. You don't see me. You don't see me. Woosa, woosa. Let's see, I'll 
so. Well, that's okay. I'll just have to take them a little slower once I get until I get some uh, ammo. Say a little slower, and I just ran right up and punched him in the face. Seriously? Yeah, j just pick these guys off at a distance if you can. That's why I'm using a scout rifle right now. That and I have no uh, solar uh, snipers. Punch. Yeah, I think that's the best part about being a sun singer is my, uh, even my punches are flame elements. Uh, I do a bit more damage. He resisted that more than I thought he would. But, oh well, he's down. Like, if you have a flame melee of any kind, and you melee it in their shield and they're about to die, uh, they'll still catch fire, and they'll they'll probably still kill them. He's dead. Yeah, I think in this zone, I don't think this is a darkness zone. So if you die, you'll just respawn in five seconds. So if you're a sun singer, don't bother uh, don't bother self-resurrecting because you, you'll be back. You won't even lose any progress on these guys. Probably make it if I run through right now. Oh, what am I stuck on? There we go. That observation tower overhead. There's bound to be a way to locate the spire there. Uh, these guys are super low level right now. Once you deploy the ghost, uh, you just go ahead and run on. Where is it? I got it. It's on the other side of another defense line. Well, if they didn't already know we're coming, they do now. Let's see. Okay, I do have ammo for my uh, fusion rifle. I'll go ahead and help kill these guys. Yeah, I pick up some more. Nope. Oh, spoke too a little too soon. There we go. This will help in the next fight. I believe this is going to be a darkness zone. Uh, I think they just invited us in. 
Oh, I think I just they just invited us in. I'm Dinklebot. Yeah, just, just take this at your own pace. You have to kill everybody. Just uh, yeah, stay around here. You can usually kill them before they get too too close. But I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna obviously let them get a little closer. I make use of my uh, fusion rifle as much as possible. Huh. This seems more effective when you don't aim down the sights. There's me guys to your left. Yeah, I haven't had the opportunity to level this this gun up too much. Eventually it'll have like an eight round clip. And I'll be able to uh, fire it full auto just off of one charge. be a Colossus coming up. I don't find Colossi Colossi's boss eye too too much of a threat. And they, they just have a lot they have a lot of firepower. But they're usually pretty easy to manage. Well that was a Big miss on my part. Yeah, do not neglect your slide ability. It's got me uh, have a lot of jams. That wasn't too, okay, too bad. To work on this door. Let's ground up some ammo. Let's see, is there a green ammo? Green Ingram. I think the other side of this door, some guys will show up. So they're they're not too difficult to deal with. The only ones who are any threats the phalanxes. But stuff. And I'll just rocket him. Huh. Yeah, I just blew away that rocket ammo. I didn't know that was possible. We're getting close. I think this is the one where you have to cross a bridge. We have to cross yep. that bridge. Oh, didn't I just say that? 
I'm sorry, Dinklebot's really not that There's bad. It's just that when, when you've heard him so much, I mean, just everything he says is annoying. I mean, he's much more annoying, annoying than Cortana ever thought to be. Sit back and save my rockets for the boss. Two rockets should be more than enough to either outright kill him or put him very, very close to death. Guys, gives me some uh, special ammo here soon. If you guys haven't te couldn't tell by now, I, I don't use the fusion rifle very often. Usually only when there's a, a challenge or something, you know, kill two guys or whatever. Yeah, I don't play very much of the PvP. I don't know, I just find it very unbalanced, at, you know, as it currently is. I mean, I, I have fun with it, but I don't know, I guess I expected something a little more competitive. I, I especially from the makers of you know Halo 2 you know, and Halo 3 not so much reach although uh, don't get me wrong I, I do enjoy reach oh, oh, I didn't see that special ammo there yeah I do enjoy reach I, it's not my favorite Halo game but uh, you'll probably see me streaming all the Halo games soon enough don't want to kill all those guys. I have to kill everybody again, so I'm just going to use my super. Where are you? Yeah, I mainly have my super just to bring myself back from the dead. Everything else is a uh, secondary to that. I mainly use the sticky grenades. I find them a bit more useful than the uh, the vortex. And the vortex, uh, like it, it creates a choke point where they they can't come through for a while. I find, but like, as far as like straight DPS and stuff, I, I find the sticky grenades are a bit better. It does uh, straight damage that's, you know, always that's the always going to hit them. Whereas, uh, otherwise, with the uh, you know, Vortex stuff, you kind of have to hope they are just stupid enough to sit there. Which, admittedly, the AI in this game isn't great, so they, they probably end up wood sitting there. to the spire. Get me close. I have no idea what's about to happen. You never do, Dinklepot. You never do.
Yeah, whenever uh, whenever the Master Chief Collection comes out, you'll probably see us streaming uh, you know, Halos 1 through 4. Then I'll, I'll go back and stream uh, Reach and ODST later on. Like, uh, I did just buy Halo 2 Vista, so uh, I've been thinking about streaming that as well. You can't tell I'm, I'm a huge Halo fan. Uh, that's why I was kind of disappointed with this game. Just, just expected a little more from the makers of Halo. Don't be wrong, it's a fun game. But it has, it has a little, it has some problems here and there. Okay, all the enemies should despawn as soon as you kill the boss, so... Like, I don't even bother. Is charged. It's time to enter the Black Garden and finish this. Oh look, more robes. Dismantle. Every much to progress uh, past 29, you, you have to complete the raid. I mean, you, there's no other way to you know, really get get stronger besides that. Uh, I think 30 is the cap right now. I mean, they'll, they'll probably end up raising it whenever the expansion packs come out. Okay, well, uh, this has been Ben, this is Disc Pistol. Uh, you guys have a good one. And, uh, hope to see you guys back real soon.